Hi, uh, my name is Michael and today we're gonna do Coding Dojo. So today's task is to, to get highest scoring word. What does it mean? I'll let, let's pause for a second and I will let you read the description. Okay, so as you know the problem already, we're gonna choose the word that have like the bigger the biggest score. So for A is one, for B is two, for three. That's mine. That's my example. So what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna take this string, we're gonna split it. And then we're gonna count each letter, so we will know if the word, what the, what's the word value. And then we're gonna compare if this word is bigger or smaller than the highest score word. And let's keep in mind that uh, if there are two words that are the same, we need to return this one that was earlier so in our approach in my approach i will i will start from the back and then go to to start okay so in this example i created i created these two words they have the same value the value is 27 and we want to get this one because this one is like earlier so what we're gonna simply do is have this variable and we'll just we'll just go and and put if this one is the big if this one is the biggest one we, we're gonna put and save it then we're gonna go to the next one and if we're gonna grab this one again which has the same score so the highest score we're gonna save it as well and that's why that's how we're gonna solve the issue of getting the earliest because it will be the last in our case so it's much it will be much easier okay so let's start coding I will start with creating two variables. Uh, highest score, which will be zero. Last word, and this will be empty string. Mm, yes. Yeah, so let's let's check what is in given x uh, yeah so that's our our string we got we want to split it so we have uh, every word in different in different item in array so we're gonna go words We're gonna split on space. Perfect. So now we're gonna have the same words but in in array. So now we have this in array. We're gonna go through all of the items. And we're gonna go backwards as we said before. So we covered the rule that is instructions words then and minus one then zero back, back. cool mm. Okay, uh, so now we're gonna go for every word. Just that would be fine. Okay. 
how create the variable word. So I know where are we in the in the loop words index cool so now I will console log word and so we what we want to do is we wanna count all of the letters inside of it so we need the like a counter variable so we const uh, word score counter um, this will be zero and word but we also use split here so it will split every separate layer for each letter cool so now we're splitting all letters separately and we want to sum up the the word score so in order to get it we need to know the value of it of the of the of the character so for a is one and every every letter every symbol has its own ascii code so for a is 27 and for this 122 so as we know from the from the instruction uh, all the letters are lowercase and it was validated so that let's make it much more easier um, okay so now we know that a is 27 so what I want to do is I want to convert the letter to ASCII code and then do the calculation minus 96 so a will be 1 and every other letter will be incrementally bigger so I'll put the comment here that a equals 7 so we have the letter car hold at zero index so in this string take zero index minus 96 so so if we go 7 minus 96 will equal 1 right, right. so we something like this okay uh, so now we will be able to have the word and check if the word was the score of the score of it. Okay, we have some error. Where's the error? Okay, assigning to const variable. Sure. So this one is let. Okay, perfect. So now we know know the values of each word, which is which is fine. Um, yeah, so we're halfway there. Now we need to just update these two variables, highest score and highest word. To do it, we'll just go if uh, word score counter is, is bigger or equal to the highest. Score. Then take the highest score. I just copy and paste it. So take the highest score. 
and use this one and in the word use word the okay. highest word will be word okay and this is basically it now we have to just return uh, highest word highest word yep so let's try the simple examples if it will work okay simple example works now let's try our example this one abx id okay so i'm gonna add another test so it's uh, abx iapc xpa something like that right abx iabc xpa okay perfect and for this one we want to F A B X as the first one. Cool, perfect. So this test also passed. And let's try the whole. Perfect. Uh, so everything is working as I expected. Um, I hope you like my video and you learned something from it, how the process works with with doing this kind of mm, puzzles, tasks, function, writing code. Uh, yeah, so stay tuned and see you. See you later.